Hey pretty gang, it is Jen and I want to come in and talk to you guys about how to spend your stimulus check. Yes, this is the second go around because of course my audio was not plugged in. But hashtag pretty gang in the comments. Number one, if you are ready, I dropped A or will be dropping A YouTube class. Make sure you're checking that out in the description below. Let's get into it. How to spend your stimulus check money. Okay, I know I'm a day late and a dollar short, but for a couple of us, we either gotten a check and still have it or we haven't gotten it and it's on its way so the first thing i want to recommend that you do is one set up your business keyword set up i didn't say launch i didn't say go out here and start you know pushing to make sales not because you can't but because you first have to build your authority you need to build your audience and in order to do that you must establish the brand create a couple of products and set up this business so i need you to set up a business a couple of businesses that you can set up under a hundred dollars are a boutique that boutique can either be something that you create on your own on website on Instagram um, through Shopify or it can be an Etsy shop it can be a Poshmark store it could be an eBay store the next thing you can do is if you're if you've been around been around the pretty money gang you guys know that um, I talk about braiding. Braiding is a business that you can get into very low entry as long as you have this skill make sure you guys are checking out my how um, you can start your braiding business with $10 like I did. Check that on a, in the description below. The next thing you can do is you can coach. If there is something that you know how to do and you can coach somebody through, definitely you can get into coaching and teaching. If you know how to do a specific thing and you can get people from point A to Z through teaching, that's something that you can look into doing. The great thing about all of the businesses I just named, they are $100 or less to start, very low entry as long as you have this skill. So the first thing I think that you should do with your stimulus check is set up your business. The second thing that you should do with your stimulus check would definitely be to manage your money. Now, unlike my previous video where I shared with you guys what I believe we should be doing with our emergency funds, um, I did, I said emergency funds, I said what we should be doing with our um, income tax refund was build an emergency fund. Well, we are now experience, experiencing a pandemic probably around the time that you are either watching this or we'll be past the pandemic by the time you watch this and you would need to know that setting up an emergency fund is awesome but we're slap dab in the middle of a crisis so it's kind of a little late for the emergency fund but definitely think you need to get into budgeting your bills if you're anything like me you definitely need to look over your budget what are you spending your gross you know what is your grocery budget How, what are you spending on fast food what are you spending on um, extracurricular activities or personal things especially at this time your budget should be very 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 lean it shouldn't be that much gas gas prices are so ridiculous ridiculously low i just saw gas today for 209 i have not seen gas for 209 since i've been in the south okay in california we don't see those kind of prices so you need to be paying attention to what are you spending your current money on what are you spending your current funds on keep that in mind and you definitely need to look into watching your budget the next thing that you need to think about is paying a bill in advance yes you think to yourself okay what is that going to help me do well a bill in advance is going to help you do a lot of things a bill in advance is one less thing for you and your family to worry about the next month over and especially getting the stimulus check a lot of us let's be honest we didn't have the money coming so if you can pay a bill in advance especially because they're saying that this pandemic or the shelter you know stay in shelter orders are going to stay until june so if you're listening to this in april we have april may and june so you can pay a bill for up to three months in advance so at least we can make it through the shelter stay in order until people can get back on their feet and we can get back to quote unquote normal and the last thing you definitely want to do when you're managing your money especially the stimulus check money is you need to save five hundred dollars it is a statistic that four in ten adults in america can cover a four hundred dollar emergency without using a credit or b selling something that is of value to them so definitely save this money because as you guys know this is life and in life things happen it's not if they're going to happen it's when they happen and there are going to be things that are going to come up medical bills are going to come up right Audio is going to, I said audio, auto is going to come up. Your car, house is going to come up. Perfect example. Um, just yesterday, a contractor finally finished my roof. I had 
four leaks in my roof. It started off with two, turned into four quickly. Um, I had the contractor here for four days in a row working just on my roof. And luckily I had the monies because that is a emergency that we don't think about. So definitely you wanna look into saving your money. And the last thing that you definitely need to do with your stimulus check is you need to think about stocking up or keeping on hand essentials and necessities. Definitely wanna get food, non-perishable items. You definitely wanna be you know, freezing things if you can, purchasing canned goods if you can. Um, also keep medication you know, prescriptions um, refilled or keep them close by um you definitely want to keep cleaning supplies as well as well as personal hygiene um especially things such as diapers um you want to look into that paper goods we know everybody was going it was a craze for toilet paper just the other day and just get some extra things batteries flashlight candles there are small little necessities that we need and we can just stock up on using this stimulus check money so definitely want you to a set up your business B, manage your money, and C, make sure you're stocking up on your essentials and necessities. So you guys, I hope this was helpful, and so glad one of the Pretty Money Gang members told me that, hey, you have no audio, so I'm going to re-upload re this. And thank you guys so much for listening. Talk to you guys later. Bye, you guys.